Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Des and today we have a very exciting video. We are doing another unboxing and try on haul for the brand new cake collection by Buff Bunny Collection. This collection is launching this Saturday, 25th at 1 p.m. CST or 11 a.m. PST if you're my time. And I am just so excited to show you guys what's in this box because the colors are so beautiful. As you can tell, I do love my colors and this collection is just full of some of my favorites, including a lot of lavender. And that's like why I'm so obsessed. For a split second, I almost didn't get my package in time. I am the last one of all the Buff Bunny girls to get their package because I had four packages stuck in Vegas since February 28th. So that's a whole other story. I thought we almost had a Buff Bunny bandit amongst us again, but they sent a new one. So I finally got it. So now we can finally unbox it together. Okay, so before I even get into the new pieces, let's talk about what I'm already wearing. These are the Onyx Black Foxy Flare Leggings. They are a flare pant and they are restocking. The thing about the Foxy Flare Leggings, they are amazing. I wear my flare pants pretty much every single day. I kid you not. I have black, I have stardust, I have very peri, which is a periwinkle color, and I have the olive green. Between all those four colors, I'm always wearing them. I wear my stardust and my onyx black the most, and I do get a lot of compliments on them. Just most people tell me like, oh, I don't even know like how I would wear those to the gym. I don't know what I would wear those with. Here's the thing. I have worn mine to the gym, but I don't typically wear them to the gym. Like that, I wear them around the house. I wear them on every errand that I'm running. When I'm going to the grocery store, when I'm going for a coffee run, it's all of those moments that I'm just wearing my comfies like I just refer to them as my comfies I also went out last weekend in my flare pants in the stardust and it was actually a very cute look so a couple details we don't have the front seam so we love that just like the leggings and then they do have the booty contour in the back and they're just very comfortable like I I love them so much but I feel like they're just like really cute with like a simple crew neck sweater or just something kind of warm and comfy I do wear them with sports bras sometimes but then I feel like I'm like in a gym outfit so that's just kind of like a little way that I kind of dress it up for like non gym outfits and then up top I'm wearing the crystal crop we just relaunched this in the last collection but it's still in stock and I ordered this on launch day so um, it's new to me and there's like these really cute like long lines and it's just like a longer top so it's very modest, very nice, and I really like how this longer crop top looks with the flares. All right, what do we think? What do we think? These are the Foxy Flare leggings in the color Stardust, paired with the Candy Wrap Sports Bra, also in Stardust. And I just love these so much. Um, a little NSV for me since starting my weight loss journey, non-scale victory. For anyone not watching, I used to be 300 pounds. So it's little things like this that I am still celebrating five years into my journey. The fact that I can now wear light colors as a big girl, I was always told how black colors are more flattering, black hides everything. And now I find it so fun to be able to wear light colors and the thing is is that I've got lots of loose skin lots of cellulite lumps and bumps there's no hiding it but with a good material honestly you could barely tell to me this definitely passes the cellulite check I'll come up nice and close but I could totally order something else similar color and I won't even really feel comfortable wearing it like without something kind of hiding my my butt and thighs because it'll just show everything so I'm gonna actually put on this little piece that I got from Amazon just to like be able to show you guys side by side on what these materials do because I know so many of you guys that are watching are like oh no I would never be able to wear that color it's gonna show everything I'm gonna show you the actual living proof that this material, the quality, it's like so thick and hides everything that this is like, to me, like an eight, nine out of 10 cellulite check, okay? Like, of course you could still see a little bit, but nothing compared to if I was gonna wear a thin material. So look at this. All right, you see, this is exactly what I'm talking about. This is a little jumper that I got off of Amazon and it's a very thin material. As you can see, it's not very forgiving at all. You could see all of my lumps and bumps. You could even see what color underwear I'm wearing. I bet you didn't know I was wearing dark brown underwear before, but with the thin material, you can totally see through it. You see a lot more lumps and bumps. This material is so thin, and I just wanted to be able to show you guys that that light material is actually so thick that it does hide a lot, even the color of my underwear. I mean, I probably wouldn't be able to get away with wearing black, but this dark brown color that I'm wearing, you could barely even tell in the, in the buff bunny pants. With this, I would never be able to get away with it. And to be honest, I wouldn't even feel comfortable like walking around the grocery store or like being out showing this much like I, that's just a little too much for me that makes me feel a little a little insecure 
Now, with my Buff Bunny pants, I don't feel that way at all, and that's why they're just such an NSV for me. I love to be able to wear the light colors. I've always wanted to be able to feel comfortable and confident in light colors, and I'm pretty much only there uh, if it's with Buff Bunny. So try them out. I promise they are actually very nice on us girls that do have the lumps and bumps. Here it is, the new frosted purple set in the Legacy leggings and the brand new Sculpt Seamless bra. I am obsessed with this color. This is my favorite color in this collection. Is this a perfect match? <laughs> Stop. Obviously, I love all purples and shades of lavender, but I'm actually really surprised by this sports bra. It's very stretchy. Remember how small it looked? It definitely stretched out, but it, de it does feel snug, especially for a size medium. It definitely fits me closer to a size small. So if you are in between sizes, size up on the Sculpt Seamless Sports Bra. It is very stretchy and very comfortable, but I don't want you to be getting anything too small and having to go through the return process. Sometimes that could be a, a hassle. But this is the back. It has a really simple crisscross back with a little logo on it. And then the Legacy leggings, obviously they are just like all of our other Legacy leggings. But what I've noticed before in the past, like with the polka dot ones, these ones are also Legacy leggings. But when I very first put them on, these launched February of last year. But I remember thinking like, wow, for whatever reason, these like feel a little snugger on me. And I have this theory, now I could be crazy, but I have this theory that certain colors in the Legacy leggings or in like new breed material items, if it's a lighter color, it seems like it runs smaller. Like even my black small Legacy leggings sometimes feel like they're a medium. And I'm like, are these a medium or small? Like it, it's just like black and darker colors seem to be a little bit more stretchy or like fit a little bit better and then the lighter colors sometimes seem like they do run a little bit differently but like not a crazy difference I just feel that it is a little bit more snug like they're not like too tight or anything if you are in between sizes on the lighter colors of the legacy leggings then size up that way you're not uncomfortable and like dealing with any you know spilling with your loose skin or anything like that like what I've got going on <laughs> and before I take these off they are gonna be relaunching in a couple new colors and restocking in the black if you don't don't own the black ones already then you need to get those at least because they are an everyday legging they match everything and they make everyone's booties look amazing but the colors that are coming out this weekend are the frosted purple we have stardust coming out the eggplant purple the purple swirl print and then also baked blue which is like a really pretty dark turquoise navy blue color I really wanted to see how these would look with the purple swirl print pattern and I'm just actually in love with it I love this color combo and I love how this color just helps bring out all of those different shades of purple so these are the siren shorts there's no front seam they have this really cute detail the crisscross front is like my favorite I feel like it just kind of cuts you in and then in the back there is the little three line booty contour just like all of the legacy leggings just very flattering and these are also four inches just like the legacy shorts with this collection something that you guys should know for anyone who wants a longer short they are launching a couple legacy shorts like a few of the colors in also six inches so there's gonna be four inches and then a few colors launching in the six inches and the six inch legacy shorts are only launching in the color eggplant purple and onyx black so the darker colors but these are the siren shorts and they're very very comfortable i love how stretchy they are i like to order my shorts in a size medium just because even though my leggings are size small and i like how it feels up here i like a little bit more length on my legs and i find that when i go smaller then they just get a little shorter so i like to size up on my shorts personally even though it doesn't always like snatch me in as much as like a small legging would like really compress me I find that these aren't as compressive once I wear them in a size medium but I feel a lot more comfortable in them because they're not riding up a bunch okay and we do have some updates on the shorts so it says total rise decrease to improve the fit prevent the waistband from rolling slight decrease to the waist decrease to hip to be consistent with all shorts okay so that's exactly what um, I was talking about with like the monarch leggings the sides they go up really high sometimes so they've actually worked on making this a little bit better of a, a fit and to make it more cohesive with the other shorts and leggings that we have so even though we have the crisscross we're not gonna go all the way up to our bra anymore like that's how my monarch leggings were last time and I mean, I didn't, I didn't really care because I love them so much, but I think that the, the adjustment that they made was very necessary and I really like it. Okay, now I paired them with the Cake Pop Candy Wrap Sports Bra and I love this combination together. I actually think this color helps bring out all of these colors a little bit more than the Frosted Purple. And I'm just falling more and more in love with these shorts because they match so much. I love a good versatile piece. If I can make multiple outfits out of one thing, then that's like a really good purchase. I love how Buff Bunny Collection does a really good job of that. And they always keep in mind about previous collections, like colors that have launched before. When they make patterns like this, they keep that in mind. Like, oh, this color from this collection could go 
with that. So I'm sure I could even pull out some colors from here and it would be perfect match. So for example, if you have Lotus, let's see, do we like this combination together? Ooh, ooh, that's pretty cute. Oh my gosh, you guys, if you have any of the Buff Bunny Bandit purple Lotus, this is so cute. I really like this roll pattern with Lotus. And then just to compare, this is what all the colors look like together. So, wow, how cute. All of these colors would look so good with the swirl shorts. And I just love the candy wrap sports bra because this little ruching area, like you could kind of really adjust however you want. So if I like do a little tug and pull, then I could make this as boobalicious as I want. And I can put these kind of up higher for like an extra lift, or I could like loosen them up a little bit and then it kind of drops a little bit. I'll show you guys the back again, but um, about the sizing for the Candy Wrap Sports Bra, this one, it's pretty true to size, but if you are in between sizes, I would size up because I can wear a size medium or a small in sports bras, but I prefer my mediums in this one just because this is like a very snug, like it's not snug, but it's a very thick, sturdy strap. And because this bra is so popular, they're bringing it back in actually quite a few colors. I think seven colors. We have the Cake Pop Pink, Frosted Purple, Baked Blue, which is like that dark turquoise navy color. We have White, Stardust, Key Lime Pie, and the Dark Egg plant purple. Okay, I am immediately noticing the difference in the update to these leggings. Look where they're cutting, like right here in like my mid waist, which is perfect because last time they did go up like more towards my rib cage, which I didn't hate, but they were a bit long and then they would try to slide down a little bit because they were so long and I have a shorter torso. So where they're hitting now is perfect. I'm wearing these in a size small and if you are in between sizes, just size down because this is a very stretchy legging. The material is definitely very forgiving. And just a couple close up things to show you guys. We have the cute little crisscross detail. There's no front seam. We've got pockets. We have the booty contour in the back, just like legacies. And they are Nubri. So that stands for nude and breathable material. They feel like butter. A lot of people compare these leggings and this material to the Align leggings by Lululemon. I've never tried them, so I can't say for myself, but I've heard a lot of my Buff Bunny friends say that. I just love them so much. This color is very cute. I love this as a complete set together. Like that is just so cute. And before I take them off, they are restocking the black ones. So we will have black again. They're launching in this brand new cake pop color. They're also coming out in the eggplant purple and they're also coming out in baked blue, which is like that turquoise deep navy color. And now for the highly anticipated BBL leggings, not for Brazilian butt lift, but for buff bunny lift. These are a new seamless legging that we just came out with. They do have like an under glute contour, which is kind of cool. It helps give that little lift. But a couple notes, at least to me, is that this waistband is actually so compressive that I think if you're in between sizes, you're gonna need to size up because I don't even really usually deal with the issue of having my loose skin pool over my leggings, but this is just so compressive that I'm actually dealing with that a little bit. So I wish that I would have ordered these in a size medium had I known that the waistband was that compressive. But other than that, I do like it. The material is really thin. It's definitely more of like a sporty material. It's kind of, it's not Nubri. It's not like, it's like a very like athletic material. Now we don't have a name for it yet, but we, I can tell you what's in it. It is polyester, nylon, and lycra, lycra. Inseam is 24 inches, full length legging, medium compression. These are high compression. Um, high waist, under glute contour, and compressive ribbed waistband, no front rise seam. I do love the color of these leggings. It looks very cute with the cake pot pink. Now with the waistband, you're supposed to be able to roll it down to show off this little, don't mind my surgery stitches. I just had surgery like two months ago, so I'm still healing. But this waistband is supposed to be able to roll down potentially and show like the logo. But I feel like if I were to roll it down, it wouldn't really stay more than that just because that's where it hits on my waist. But maybe if I hike it up, I could, let's see. Okay, so even then I'm trying to roll it down and it doesn't really want to stay any lower. I don't think I would ever want to roll, roll them down anyways, but I know some people do like to do that. I just don't know if it would really stay very easily. I do like how it shapes me. I do like how it's really giving me an extra bit of waist. And I think because it's making this flatter, maybe that's what's helping it kind of poke out a little bit more. I kind of like them for what they do to my waist, not even so much the booty. So I'm getting a little nervous about how it's trying to rise up around here 
but maybe in a darker color, it would be a little bit more forgiving, so I will try on the dark purple. All right, game changer, game changer. Now I have the BBL leggings in eggplant with the eggplant alpha sports bra. I love this color combo. Like I said, I love how this dark color matches the band across here. I feel like it's like a perfect match. And just like the last leggings, we still have that same little logo right above the high, very thick waistband. And then these ones, let's see how they look rolled. Oh, it's a dark print. So if you wear these ones rolled down, the print is also like that dark eggplant color. It won't stay rolled down on me, but maybe it'll work for you. Oh yeah, they're okay. Yeah, so I'm pretty much able to roll it just a little bit. I would never really wear them rolled anyways, so that doesn't really matter to me, but I do love these. I think I like the eggplant BBL leggings a little bit more than the cake pop. I think that this color is very forgiving, definitely more flattering on me, I think. But I think that I need to kind of hike up the back a little bit. So if you get these leggings and you want to make sure you get like the BBL effect, I think the trick is to make sure that this glued contour isn't on your mid thigh. Bring it up. Okay, just a little shimmy up. Oh yeah, that's a lot better. Let me go closer. Definitely a lot better. I love my other seamless leggings by Buff Bunny. Like I have a pink pair and a gray pair and they have like a little holes like mesh and I love them and like they're really compressive and they snatch me in all down my legs too. So that's why I really like seamless sets and we don't really have that many in Buff Bunny. So whenever we get them, I love to try them. This one is just so different. Like I've never had a material like this, but it is very comfortable. Let's do a little squat test. What do we think? Oh yeah, passes the squat test. Can you come closer? Yep, that passes the squat test for sure. So yeah, these are the new BBL leggings for Buff Bunny Lift. They are coming out in five colors. So we have the cake pop, we have the eggplant, we have charcoal, baked blue, and sage green. And that one's really pretty. It's like kind of closer to the key lime color that's also in this launch, but like a little bit more heathered and it's just so cute. I wish I would have gotten those. And let's take a look at the alpha bra up close. Like I said, this is one of my favorite bras. I love the deep cut. I just think it's super sexy. And I like how it's a little bit longer. Like it, it hits my waist kind of where like a crop top would, not like most of my shorter sports bras that are maybe like, that maybe end like right here. I like how it's a bit longer. And I will say the straps on the back are so thick that I never really run into the, the issue of them rolling in and like my skin hiding them. So that's what I could really appreciate about this is just how thick the straps are. There's never really any digging and it's just a very comfy bra like I love the ones that are like extra comfy this one it doesn't have like a whole lot of like structure to it it's just very like soft and flexible so it's a very comfy bra and it is restocking in black and white finally and it's also coming out in this eggplant purple and stardust and really quick for the sake of color comparing I wanted to show you guys how the eggplant purple looked with the purple swirl pattern and it's also a perfect match I just love how these shorts match almost every color in this collection I love that. I also really like how cohesive these pieces look together with like the V and the cut right here. I just think that the alpha bra looks really cute with this. I am obsessed with this color. This is the Key Lime Pie Revolution Sports Bra. It's got that square neckline. I love that so much. And we also have this beautiful strappy back detail with thick straps, so there's no digging. I also like how long it is. So when I'm wearing it with either shorts or leggings, I feel like I'm not being too immodest. I could go comfortably into Trader Joe's after my workout, still be wearing my Revolution Sports bra and shorts or leggings, and I don't feel half naked. So I love that. I also love how it looks with the Stardust color, like just pairing it with a neutral color is so beautiful. But I also have a few pieces from last year's Sugar Rush collection in Key Lime. So I have like the flow shorts that will match it perfect. And I also have a matching scrunchie. So I know that these went on sale last weekend. They might still have Key Lime in stock. I'm not sure, but make sure you check out the flow shorts because they do have Key Lime. And if it's still in stock, you could make a whole new outfit. I also really like the Revolution Sports Bra because to me, it's definitely on the higher support. Like with these thick straps, it's so supportive. And a couple notes about the shorts. These are Legacy shorts in the color Stardust. This is a four inch inseam. Just like the Legacy leggings, they have a little three line booty contour. And I'm gonna give it an eight out of 10 cellulite control. Of course, you could still see a little bit on me, but definitely not enough to where I feel like I can't wear these and that's why I love them so much. I have the flare pants in this color and I also have these shorts. These I got from a different collection, so they're old, like these are probably a few months old, maybe longer, and they are only restocking them. So there's no updates to the measurements or anything. They're just restocking this color, finally. And the Legacy shorts are launching in six colors. We have the Stardust, 
cake pot pink, frosted purple, eggplant purple, purple swirl pattern, and baked blue. And if you're wanting the Black Legacy shorts in the four inch inseam, then those should be in stock also on the website by launch day, because I just checked today and they still have some. So as long as they don't sell out in the next two days, you should be in luck. Obsessed is an understatement, okay? This is so freaking cute. This is the new corset top with the corset leggings, and I am actually obsessed. When I saw this on the email, I really expected it to be like a really thin spandexy nylon material, but now that I'm putting it on, it feels a lot like Nubri, but slightly thinner. So let me look at the email because this is not Nubri material, but it feels like it. Okay, so the corset leggings, they are nylon and spandex with an inseam of 26 inches, full length legging with light compression. They definitely are lighter compression I'd say like light to medium this wouldn't really do too much for loose skin but with this boning structure it does kind of still snatch you in so I could appreciate that and as far as the cellulite control they pass the test even more than the foxy flare leggings and the legacy shorts look at this this is like 9 out of 10 on the cellulite check like you could barely see anything I'm so shook I didn't know it could get any better than the stardust flares and the stardust legacy shorts but these hide my cellulite lumps and bumps even more. And when I was putting them on, I pretty much just stepped into them. Like all my other leggings, I kind of gather them and then I hike them up, just like a pair of tights or something. But with these, they were like so thin, stretchy and comfy that I really just stepped right into it. And they are so stretchy. Look how far out they go. These are so stretchy, so thin. They definitely are like more of a light to medium compression and i think that they only give that extra medium compression because of this boning right here and it's not like metal or anything it's just an extra stitching but i do feel like it's kind of snatching me up a little bit like giving a flat tummy so i love that i also love how cute and understated the logo is yeah, it's just safe to say that I am obsessed with this set. I think that this might be one of my favorites in the entire collection. And I am just very pleasantly surprised. Next up, we have the Lit Laser Cut Leggings. And you guys have seen these before. These actually launched during Nancy's Journey's Buff Bunny collab, the Journey Collection, in January of 2021. They're finally making a comeback. And I do love these because they have this super beautiful mesh detail. And these are actual holes. So if I put my hand here, you can see. And what I do to avoid my underwear showing through it, as you can see, it's like right there. I just lift it up over the side a little bit extra and then there's literally no issue. I've never had an issue with my underwear showing through these leggings, even though these are actual holes. It doesn't show your underwear as long as you hike them up a little bit over your hips. And what I love about these leggings is that they're Elysium material. I'm really used to like most of my Buff Bunny being new breed material, which I do love, but sometimes it's nice to have like an athletic spandex material. So Elysium is made of polyester and and spandex they're very comfortable very stretchy and the waistband to me it's definitely like a medium compression like this definitely snatches you in a little bit i wanted to see how it would look with the corset stardust top because this whole detail with like the skin color showing i thought it would be cute to pair it with something a similar tone so that's what that looks like but they are launching a lit laser cut sports bra that also matches and these are going to be coming out in onyx black and eggplant purple when they had nancy's journeys collection they had a long line sports bra that matched the lit laser cut leggings but this time it's really short and it's got like a really big open back i don't have one but it is very cute and I do love a matching set. So definitely check that out. Look at this combo. Onyx Black Alpha Sports Bra with the Lit Laser Cut Leggings. Deep V Cut. Okay, when I'm wearing a black set like this in the gym, I feel like a little gym baddie, okay? And it just gives me that boost of confidence. It's all about look good, feel good. Like, if I went to the gym right now, I would probably have an amazing workout just because I feel super good in this outfit. They are different materials. The Alpha Sports Bra is a new material, while this is Elysium, but I still think that they look really good together, and this is just a super sexy set. Like, oh my gosh. I I am so obsessed. All right, turns out I also love it with the white Revolution sports bra. This is so cute. I just love the square neckline. I think they look good with everything. And that's exactly why I wanted a white Revolution sports bra so that it can match everything. I would go to the gym in this exact outfit with my tall white Nike socks with the black swoosh and some white shoes. And I just love this outfit. So cute. 
And these pieces are both so versatile. All right, this is a piece I was not willing to live my life without when I saw that they were coming out with the court pleated skirt in the color peach rings. I knew I had to have it. It's just so cute and so vibrant. I have the stardust color and the black court pleated skirt from the last collection. I've had a lot of fun dressing them up and dressing them down with either crew necks or just like little jackets or like a sports bra just like this. I think they're so cute. And a lot of people were telling me that they loved the skirt, they just didn't know how to style it. So if you guys need some styling ideas, go watch one of my last videos with the quartz pleated skirt because I give a couple options on how to dress them up. I do love this skirt so much because we do have pockets on both sides and the shorts are also a four inch inseam just like the legacy shorts. So it's not riding up underneath. Last collection, I got a size small just like my leggings, but this collection I wanted to size up and just try medium to see how it would do on the length. And I am happy that I did. So if you're in between sizes, I kind of do want to recommend sizing up because I do feel like the undershorts are a bit more comfortable now and I also just like the little bit of added length. The last one was a little bit short like sometimes you could kind of see like the shorts underneath my booty a little bit and I don't know I just like to be a little bit more modest than that. This skirt is just so fun. I really envision it just like on a nice sunny day using it to just go get my coffee, go shopping. I would definitely dress it up for like an athleisure outfit because, well, I don't play tennis or anything, but I sure do love these skirts. Oh, and before I take it off, the court pleated skirt is coming out in another color. It's the baked blue color. And if you want to explore the other colors, they are still in stock, just not every size is still in stock. So you have to check if they have yours, but you can also see that they have this skirt in onyx black and stardust. Okay, I just paired the peach ring skirt with the crystal crop and I love this one together. With the Revolution sports bra, it also looked cute, but I like how with the longer top, it seems to me like more of like an everyday going anywhere kind of outfit, a little less skin showing. I'm a lot more comfortable in this, especially because it's a skirt, so a little less skin if I have all of this and this showing, sometimes I feel a little exposed. So the crystal crop with the court pleated skirt is like my favorite combo. And if you saw my last YouTube haul for the court side collection, I showed that I had my crystal crop, but I had a size medium and the bottom really didn't taper to my body. It kind of hung off like this. So I ordered a size small and I just got it. So now this is my new updated crystal crop and I cannot get over how perfect it fits. I love how the lines come down right here. So it just gives that little extra structure and like brings the waist in. And when you turn around, you can see how high it goes up. I just love that. And it's got the cute little metal dainty logo with a swoop neck. It's just so cute. I just love this skirt so much. And if you are gonna get it, definitely try pairing it with the crystal crop because this is like a perfect combo. Now, before I wrap up this video, I do wanna finish it off with a couple of color comparisons. So this is the Peach Rings Monarch Sports Bra. I got this during the Sugar Rush collection last year and they don't have it coming out again in the Monarch Sports Bra. They're gonna be launching this color in the Revolution Sports Bra, the one with the square neckline. When I got the Dawn Monarch Sports Bra during the Storm Collection, I literally said in my video how it's kind of like a muted version of this one and holding it up against the skirt, I just feel like this is such a cute combination. It's like basically tones of peaches. This is like the darker, more vibrant one. And then this is like just muted and understated. And I think that this is so beautiful together. These colors like... Wow, so cute. I love everything peach and coral and pink. Like those are all my favorite colors. So if you also love your peaches, then go check out the Dawn Monarch Sports Bra because this one is still in stock. And then I really wanted to do a color comparison with the frosted purple for you guys because this is the one that's coming out in this collection. In the Storm Collection, we launched this beautiful vapor color and it had a little bit more of like a gray tone to it. So next up would be the frosted purple, a little bit more lavender, a little bit more color added to it. And then I wanted to show you guys the Buff Bunny Bandit Lotus, definitely a very vibrant purple. And then also compared to the Very Perry, also like more rich, kind of more on the blue side. So this is a really nice color comparison for you guys. Anyone who might already have these colors and you're not sure how they're gonna look, just wanted to show that for you guys. I think that's it. That's everything I got for this collection. There are a ton of other beautiful pieces that are coming out that I just didn't get. Like there's this like really cute butter crop top that's like an everyday lifestyle piece. And that would look really cute with the skirts and the foxy flare pants. So I know I'm gonna be personally picking those up on launch day. I probably will get black, white, and maybe the Stardust, just depending how spendy I'm feeling, we'll see. And to anyone that does shop the collection this weekend and uses my code DES, I just wanna say thank you so, so much in advance for using my code because it does support me directly, but it also lets the team know who sent you. And I'm just very grateful to be able to be in this position, to be a Buff Bunny Collection athlete, 
get these pieces ahead of time, show you guys all my favorite details, and just be a part of their fam. So I am just very thankful to each and every single one of you who does use code DES or Bandit because it's still active. And like I said, if you guys have any questions about this launch, please just let me know and I would love to get those answered for you. Thank you so much for sitting through this entire video and I will see you on the next one.